Good day. I'm Penley, Penley the Penguin, and I'm here to share with you some interesting math facts and to help you with your knowledge of penguins. Many times people ask me, are there any albino penguins? That means all white penguins, and there are. They're rare, and it's to their disadvantage because they, when they're in the water, Albino penguins can be seen more easily from overhead. Even rarer than albino penguins are penguins that are all black. They have the same disadvantage when seen from below, they contrast with the bright sky and they can be seen more easily. Thus, more vulnerable to predators. We're going to learn today about how to multiply one digit numbers by multiples of 10 using the associative property and factoring. 90 times 6. We can factor 90 into 10 times 9. Then multiply that by 6. We should associate the 9 times 6 first. So now you have 10 times 54. When you multiply 10 times a whole number, you add a 0 to the right. So we get 540 as our product. Let's do another example. 30 times 8. 30 times 8 can be, 30 can be factored into 10 times 3 times 8. First we're going to multiply the 3 times 8 and we get 10 times 24. Remembering our rule about multiplying by 10, we get 240 as our product. Now let's say we have a multiple of the 10 as the second factor. We can still factor 40 into 4 times 10. And we'll just have the 10 last. So we have 7 times 4 times 10. We'll associate 7 times 4, which gives us 28, times 10. And remember the rule of multiplying 10 times a whole number, and you get 280. I hope you increased your knowledge about math and about penguins.